Did that. There's some really lovely Christmas lights up on homes uh, around the town, and uh, this time we're going to focus on one in Thornhill. Definitely, we think, the very best. I'm here in Rosia Court in Thornhill, and guys, you have really gone to town on the lights this holiday season. How many lights are we talking about here? We have 15,000 lights, which draw more than 44,000 watts, but these are all computer animated to music. You can come around and tune in on your radio to 104.9 FM and enjoy the whole show. Hey, a fantastic job. Take me around there. All right, uh, well, what we're going to do is we'll start on the right of the driveway here. This is a new grass grid we did this year, all in blue, and it, and it actually got dimming, too. New, uh, part of our display this year has dimming, which is new. All right. Uh, we've got snowmen throwing snowballs, which is uh, actually from last year, but this year we've added them throwing snowballs up onto the roof mm -hmm. and uh, activating the lights on the roof there, which is there's thousands of red bulbs on there, which are all animated as well. The snowman then throws a snowball over the driveway. Right. Uh, to the left side here okay. and activates this grid on the left of the driveway um, and then just above the grid is uh, an animated present wrapping machine that we've got what this does is you got toys going in the left side mm -hmm. it wraps the toys and spits out a present oh, it's fantastic so how long have you been doing this for We've been doing this for uh, well, the last five years. We've had it animated, but uh, we've been putting them up since we were at least you know, 10 years old. We have some pictures of us going way back, putting them on trees. And, and, and why? Why do this? The main reason why we do this is for charity. I mean, uh, last year we managed to raise over $6,000 for local charities, including, including the OSPCA, Chum City Christmas Wish Fund, and uh, Princess Margaret Hospital. And uh, we've had, you know, three busloads of people come around already this year. And we've, you know, we usually get around, like, we're guesstimating around 10,000 people come around every year. And luckily the neighbors haven't been complaining too much. So I think, I think they, pretty, they pretty much support everything, which yeah. is great, great. But we've got all the details on our website, www.lindsaylights.com. You can check out, we've got pictures, videos from previous years, from this year, current status, uh, webcams, and all the good stuff. Hey. Yeah. Thanks a lot, guys. It's a fantastic display. I could just stay here all night and just chill out and watch the light display go on. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Thank you. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. <laughs> They've been doing that since they were 10. That's so great. Well, Martin and Andrew's spectacular light display just won the 2004 Worldwide Christmas Lighting Contest. And believe you me, like thousands of people compete in this. So congratulations to those guys. Because wow. I think it's great. Which, you know, if there's any cash involved, there'll be more animated stuff next year on the house. I wonder how many people, they've counted how many people really stop by and look at that house on a daily basis or night.